to uh, welcome everyone to Where Are You Going Wednesday. And uh, I'm here today to give you another tip. Last week we talked about making a packing list. And we got some really good questions. And if you did not see um, Follow Up Friday, so that you can see a little bit more in-depth answer to some of the questions we got on that, please check the video. It is in the... Um, in, in the videos so if you haven't had a chance to see that if you look in the library videos you'll be able to see that um, we answered those questions last week on follow-up Friday so today on where are you going Wednesday if you are watching this um, put in the comments if you're traveling this weekend where you're leaving to where are you going on Thursday where are you leaving for the weekend if you're doing anything even if you're doing a staycation please do that um, but today I want to talk about giving a tip on making a copy of your ID. So that is my tip. Make a copy of your ID, maybe if it's your passport, if it's your uh, driver's license and birth certificate, whatever you're using to identify yourself to travel, make a copy of it. This way, if you do end up losing it, you at least have a photocopy of it on your phone or a photocopy of it in your bag. Um, I also recommend that you make a copy of your itinerary and put that in your suitcase. So if something does happen to your suitcase, um, they at least know where you're going to be and you can try to get married back to your, your baggage if it happens that you do get separated from it. So that's my tip for today is to A, make a copy of your ID driver's license, birth certificate, and passport or passport, however you're traveling and whatever you're using to identify yourself to travel with, make a copy of it. If you lose it, at least you have a copy of it. You can print it out. You can actually still use it. If you're using your um, passport or your driver's license, make sure you take a pack picture of the um, scan bar. So if somebody needs to, they can actually still scan it. So you want to make sure that you have the scan bar as part of that as well. So make a copy of that. Um, if you ever get miss, if you're ever, if your ID ever goes missing or you can't find it, you'll at least be able to have a copy of it to get on the plane, to get back on the boat, um, to get back um, to talk to somebody at the embassy. If you need to talk to someone at the embassy, having your a copy of your passport is always good. I make a photocopy and take a picture. So I have both of them whenever I travel. So I have a picture of my driver's license front and back. I have a picture of my passport um, with the scan bar and I actually have photocopies that I carry with me as well just to make sure that I have proper identification in case I actually lose the physical copies that I have. The other thing that I do is I actually make a copy of my itinerary and I place that in my luggage so if I do get separated from my luggage and someone's able to find it, if they open it up, they can at least see if I'm supposed to be in Puerto Rico and my bag is in Florida. Um, they can look at my itinerary and say, oh, this bag is supposed to be in Puerto Rico um, and get it to the correct place for me to get back to my luggage. Hopefully you found this helpful. Um, and if you did, I appreciate any feedback or any um, comments that you have. You can put those below. Um, underneath the um, video. Thank you for joining me today and we'll see you next Wednesday for the next session of Where Are You Going Wednesday. Thanks. Please help build our channel. Like and subscribe if you thought this video was informative and if you'd like to continue to see more Where Are You Going Wednesday tips. Thanks. Like and subscribe. Like and subscribe.